Hey guys, so here we are with another collective tack haul. I'm going to try and go through this as fast as possible. These are just little bits and odds and ends that I have gotten recently. Um, today I happened to go to Tractor Supply and Brenda's tack slash tack warehouse. Um, so I got a few things that I needed to buy and of course some things that I didn't need to buy. So let's just jump right into it. The first thing, let's do tractor supply. So the first thing I got was these Powerflex Vet Wraps. They are the value pack. And I got the turquoise with the blue stars. And I got this for Breeze's um, first aid kit. And so two of these are actually going to Breeze, and two of these are going to um, be in my dog's vet kit because I've been having issues with dogs and they're licking um, injuries. My little boss, she's just crazy. She don't know how to quit chasing her ball and messes up her feet. So between Breeze and Zoe, I'm going through bed rat like crazy. Anyway, so the next thing I got from Tractor Supply is this Apple a Day electrolytes. Um, I like this because it lasts a very long time. It costs the same as the, um, actually it's two dollars cheaper than the Farnam one. Apple Light, Apple, yeah. So, and. I think I've gotten Breeze accustomed to this, so I don't want to change it and then buy him something that he will not eat because he's so picky when it comes to supplements in his grain. Um, also, I bought some fly spray. I used the, what is it, Gordon's Permethrin 10. And I like this because it is a spray that you can use on your horses all your livestock, the premises, and then also you can use this on your dogs. So, um, because they go, my dogs go out in places that have ticks and fleas and stuff like that because we have a hill behind our house that has deer and all kinds of stuff and then we have other places that we go and go camping. So, I like to be able to buy things that I can use on both the horses and the dogs. And then I also bought the pie. I bought them some treats. I bought the Mana Pro Butterscotch Flavor Bite Size Nuggets. And here comes somebody who thinks they're for him. So I've never tried the butterscotch ones. So hopefully he likes them. So I like that is my tractor supply haul. Next, um, when I went to the Christian Nolting um, dressage derby, um, I got a few things from there. Um, they had a vendor called the Red Mare, I think it was called. And they're going out of business, and so everything was 50% off. Um, I did my saddle pad collection, and one of the saddle pads that I got was from there and it was 50% off. Um, a USG Hunter Green dressage saddle pad that is usually 50 something dollars and I got it for 20, so 22. Mm -hmm. So anyways, I also picked up these white gloves and they were $60, $59.99, but I got them half off. So these are for dressage. Um, they are a German brand, and they are actually leather, but they are so soft and OMG. I love these gloves. I wish I had gotten them in black. I should have. Um, so, but they're so comfortable and so soft, and they just Velcro here. Um, I'm going to do a DIY, DIY with these. I gotta add some bling. <laughs> some bling. And I'll probably film that. Um, so that was one thing I got from there. And then I bought some 
Quicksilver Color Intensifier and Shampoo for Light Horses. And I haven't even opened this yet. Yes, it is. Hopefully I do not drop this. It is the purple stuff. Yeah. Please do not spill before I put this back on. Okay. So yes, I bought that for Breeze because he has one white sock that he seems to always put on. Yeah. So. And then I also bought some Beguile Oil. Professional liniment. Yep, again, half off. So, yeah. Um, and so that was my Red Mare haul. And then I went to the tax store by my doctor in Walnut Creek. It's called Concord Feed, I believe. And I bought this hardware. I was gonna put it in his bar in his stall for his hay bag, but then I don't know, I don't think I'm gonna use it. So I have it, but I might not use it. And then I have I got some rubber bit guards. And then I've been wanting one of these because I've been wanting to try it. It's the rubber rubber. It's the plastic curry. And it's the kind that you attach to the water hose. So I wanted to try this because right now he's being turned out in a arena while I clean his stall. And, and he rolls and he gets really dusty. And so I want to try and use this to see if I can get the water really into his, like, through his fur into his skin. So yeah, I got that. Okay, guys, so if you see a definite change it's because uh, it's a whole nother day I ran out of light space yeah ran out of light and space my camera by the time I erase stuff to have more space I ran out of light so next day just got home from work I'm gonna finish this haul so whew, where I left off was I also went to Sally's and the reason why I went to Sally's is for two items for my horse. This applicator bottle, which I'm going to use for bleach water for his thresh remedy. Yes, I use a combination of half and half bleach water because that is what my farrier told me to use. That's what I use. And I don't use it to get rid of I don't use it to get rid of thrush. He's never really had thrush since I've had him. Um, I use it to clean his hooves once a week. Once a week. Um, so to make sure that he doesn't get thrush, especially now that he's stalled. So just to keep the bacteria down. Um, so no comments about, oh my god, you can't eat, please. It's what I do. So it's just what I do. Um, and then another applicator bottle, this one's small. This one is going to be for, um, I don't know, either coconut oil. You know what, I'm probably not even going to use it for coconut oil. I'm going to use this for um, my MTG. Because it's just a pain trying to get the MTG like down to the dock of his tail or to the root of his mane. Um, because this, this, this bottle, it's, you either put it in your hand and try and rub it in there or you, you know or you just pour straight from the bottle and just so this way because it has this little fine point on it that I can just squirt it hard his tail with this point and squirt oh sorry about my nails I, oh I said I was never gonna do that again anyways and just squirt it in there so that's the Sally tag haul and the last haul is Brenda's tag because I went yesterday and I bought two items First item is this pair of Tough Rider Your Grip. These are the hold on Your Euro Grip X KP breeches. So these are the knee patch breeches in charcoal. 
So this is what they look like. And the knee patch is um, silicone. And the last thing is another pair of bridges. Yes, they're both gray. They're both gray. So this one is the Equine Couture Natasha knee patch. So that's them. And there's the buttons. And it is also Euro seat. And it has a has white stitching. And a little taggy thingy there. And a faux suede knee patch and sock bottom. So yeah, that's these. And then this one has also got the sock bottom-ish thing. So yeah, that is my collective tech haul, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, and leave any requests if you have any down below. So, bye.